Hi guys, welcome back to The Crafty Author. So this is going to be our eighth video in a, the Scrap Quilt series where I'm teaching you how to make a quilt from start to finish. So I have gone ahead and I have finished all of the quilting on this quilt and now I am ready to square it up to prepare it for binding. So that is what I'm going to be showing you how to do today. And so we're going to go ahead and get started. So first, what you're going to need is you're going to need a square ruler. It will really help you. Um, if you don't have one, that's okay. You just use what you've got. You're going to need a rotary cutter and you're going to need a longer ruler. Okay. So First things first, what I like to do is I like to start off on my corner. So I'm just going to lay this down right here, my, my ruler, and get it so that it's correct. So I currently have a border of seven inches, but there was some shrinkage when I quilted this, okay? So I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to cut this border down to five inches. So what I want to do is I want to take my ruler and I'm just going to move this over to five inches on the seam line of the border. So I'm going to do that for here and I'm going to do it for the bottom one as well so that I get this perfectly squared. So as you can see, I've lined up my seam right here. So now my border is going to be five inches, okay? So there's the five, and then from the bottom, there's the bottom of this corner, I am also lining up the five here. So you can see five here on the seam and five there on the seam. Okay, so you always want to double check before you cut. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go ahead and I'm gonna make my, my first cut. But I do wanna see something here before we cut. So maybe I'll do it here instead because this is a more even line. Yeah, that's how we're going to do it. Okay. So I'm just going to fudge this a little bit just to keep it so that it's straight. All right. So now I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to make my first cut. I'm going to cut here. And I'm also going to cut this way. All right. So now we've got our first squared corner perfectly square okay so I'm going to set the ruler aside and then I'm just going to take now this quilt's pretty large um, so you want to if your quilt is big you're going to want to flatten it out now I'm going to just take my big ruler my long ruler and I am just going to line it up at five inches along the seam line just having an issue C in there for a moment. So I'm just gonna open up my blade and then I'm just gonna continue to cut up the quilt at five inches. Because we want that border like that. And I'm gonna pull the quilt and I'm just gonna continue to repeat doing that as we go along and making sure that we are lined up. Okay, so now I'm coming up to another corner and I'm just gonna do the same thing that I did before. And I'm just gonna take my square ruler I don't want 
the whole quilt falling on the floor. That's not good. And I am just going to, again, line up on that five inch line. Five and five, and we are good right here. So this is how you square up your quilt. So I'm gonna go ahead and I'm gonna finish doing this and then I will show you how we're gonna prepare the binding. So I know it was a quick little video, but I just wanted to show you how we square up the quilt um, to prepare it for binding. Uh, so if you like this video, give it a thumbs up. If you have questions or comments, please put them down below. I appreciate all of the positive comments that you leave in the comments section. I love interacting with all of you. It's awesome. I appreciate you all watching today and um, I hope to see you back here for the next episode of Preparing the Binding. And you can follow me on Facebook, Instagram, and Twitter. And also my blog is craftyauthor.com. I also have a private Facebook group called The Crafty Thanks, guys. Keep on crafting. Bye-bye.